Most people expected lawmakers to legalize pot this session. The House passed a bill and Democrats controlling the Senate and the governor's office seem to be on board. So why has that legalization effort stalled? News 13's Chris McKee explains. Yeah, Dean, Democrats seem to have all the support they needed to pass their latest effort, but that bill is stuck in a Senate committee. For those waiting to legally light up in New Mexico. We have a very strong movement of, for legalization. There have been all kinds of hopeful signs from New Mexico's Democratic lawmakers, like House Speaker Brian E. Gulf. I think we got really far. Even the governor. They've had a really productive conversation. Legislative power players seemingly all on board with the idea of making the land of enchantment the next state to say yes to recreational marijuana. But that seemingly done deal has likely been snuffed out with just hours left this session. And it's basically boiling down to whether or not uh, the Senate Finance Committee, Senator Smith, wants to give it a hearing. Well, Speaker Brian Eagle's House passed the Cannabis Regulation Act, that bill has sat in the Senate Finance Committee for a week with no action. I think the votes are there on the floor uh, to pass it in the Senate. But the longtime lawmaker and Senate Finance Committee Chair John Arthur Smith doesn't think the bill has the votes to make it out of committee. That committee has seven Democrats and five Republicans on it, but it's unclear which lawmakers have reservations. With little time left in this session, as much debate as possible is useful. While the governor says she supports legalizing pot, right now it doesn't seem to be a top priority for her administration. I want the budget and capital and all of our other priorities, sir. Yes. to get upstairs, and they had a lot of work to do. House Speaker Brian Eagle did say that legal pot would be something the Democrats would almost surely bring forward next session if it doesn't get done this year. Dean? All right, Chris, thank you. The governor says she wants to see a legal pot bill that includes safeguards to keep kids from using the drug and tough language blocking use while driving and in the workplace.